Today I want to discuss an important message for leaders at every level of our Navy. From our commanding officers to our senior enlisted leaders to our civilian directors leading at sea and ashore. You are the cornerstone of our Navy. You lead our sailors and civilians across the fleet, enabling them to do great things for our nation every single day. Through turbulent economic times, a global pandemic, and an uncertain geopolitical landscape, your leadership has been vital to keeping our Navy the strongest in the world and keeping our country safe. I ask you to listen closely to this short preview of what we're doing with Get Real, Get Better to make these things happen. Built on our core values of honor, courage, and commitment, Get Real, Get Better is the proven learning mindset of our highest performing people and teams today. People and teams that are strongly self-assessing, self-correcting, and always learning. Get Real, Get Better is fundamentally about warfighting readiness. Our Navy is operating in a battle space that is growing in terms of lethality, complexity, and scope. While there are many maritime challenges facing our country, they all largely stem from three significant trends. The erosion of credible military deterrence, particularly due to China's rapidly increasing military capabilities. Increasingly, aggressive Chinese and Russian behavior that undermines our international rules-based order. The accelerating pace of technological change and the expanding impact of the information environment. As a CNO, I rely on you and your team to keep us centered on our number one priority, preparing for and ready for combat. The key to winning in combat is to adapt, learn, and improve faster than your opponent. Each of us, and I mean every one of us, has to strive to be problem solvers, to ruthlessly commit ourselves to identifying and fixing whatever might be holding us back, while also doubling down on those things that make us great. Get Real, Get Better is about always learning as an individual and as a team, unit, command, and group. It embraces the red. In other words, we get after what's wrong so that we together are always learning to get it right. Too often in the past, the solutions to Navy problems have been to add more instructions, more requirements, and more complexity. Over time, this approach, combined with an unwillingness to accept any level of failure, has overwhelmed our people with bureaucracy. This is the Navy many of us grew up in. Grinding through the frustrating status quo was viewed as a path to success. Although this grit has its place in combat, it cannot be the primary way we lead every day. There's a better way. Get Real, Get Better is a proven mindset that every Navy leader must embrace to unlock the full potential of our people. It starts with our core values, honor, courage, and commitment as the bedrock of a winning Navy. Building from these values, Get Real is about having the courage to self-assess to build teams that embrace honest, hard, transparent looks at our performance. To understand our actual strengths and shortcomings, we must be our toughest critics. Get Better is about a commitment to improve, to be self-correcting. It's about taking pride in high standards and fixing problems together when they're small before they grow large and complex. It's about applying proven methods to get after the things that matter most in a focused and disciplined way and not by just adding activity. These principles are how our best commands throughout the Navy build winning teams today. It's time now to bring consistency across the Navy to this proven approach for leading and solving problems, narrowing the difference between our strongest and weakest teams. It's time for a clear Navy leadership standard, the get real, get better standard throughout the fleet. Over the last few years, we've been learning with the get real, get better mindset and developing the standards that will guide its deployment across the Navy. And while there's more work to be done, we are seeing improvement at every level. In our shipyards, our aircraft depots, in the acquisition community, in how we operate, and most importantly, in how we unleash the power of our people. For every meeting, every program, every problem we tackle, the Get Real, Get Better mindset is core to the learning needed to be a more ready and lethal fleet. It's making our Navy stronger and moving a generation of leaders to change with more inclusive, consequential, and transparent leadership. But first things first, 
If we expect to be transparent and operate differently, we need to get real at the flag level first. So let's get real. We see that we are falling short in paying our sailors on time. Unaccompanied housing needs work. And the quality of life for our sailors on ships and maintenance needs a strong attention. Our fleet commanders are tackling these tough problems now using the Get Real, Get Better leadership principles, working together in a more collaborative, transparent, and effective way. We owe it to you and your teams to address these issues with speed. Good, bad, or ugly, we'll provide transparency and communicate to you where we are, what we've learned, and what is being done to address these challenges. Working these problems in a different way is only a start. We are serious about changing how we operate with the Get Real, Get Better mindset. The next phase of Get Real, Get Better is to provide training this fall on the leadership standards we expect every Navy leader to embody. You'll also receive training on simple, powerful problem-solving tools and resources that have been at the heart of a number of significant Navy improvements. With this training, we expect you to do three things right away. First, act transparently up and down the chain of command. Fixing problems at speed requires strong self-assessment and bold, get real conversations. Our hardest challenges are complex. We must solve them together. We must embrace, not hide, the opportunities to improve. Unless we get real through hard conversations with each other, we cannot and will not get better. Second, determine what matters most and act on it. Our Get Better commitment to continuously self-correct requires each of us to prioritize risks and understand root cause. Instead of rushing in with temporary solutions or added requirements and complexity, we must use proven methods to focus effort to the most impactful actions and put solutions in place that last. Third, build teams that learn. The CNO's charge of command says it best. Strategic competition requires every organization to learn and get better every day. We build great teams through trust, respect, ownership, and accountability. Our strongest leaders measure themselves on the opportunities they create by removing barriers for their people, making it easier for them to understand and do their jobs. There's much more to Get Real, Get Better, but if we lead more strongly in just these three ways across the Navy as a start, we've seen that we can powerfully improve our ability to adapt, learn, and improve the keys to winning in combat. Make no mistake, it begins with us, you, are part of an incredible team of sailors, civilians, and reservists, and the strongest Navy our world has ever seen. We can't lose sight of that, and we definitely won't cede any ground to anybody. Get Real, Get Better is core of what will keep it that way, making us better and the winners in any future fight. History shows us that the Navy that learns better, learns faster, and improves quicker, gains more fighting advantages, over the long haul. The essential element to successfully doing this is fostering a culture that can assess, that can correct and innovate better than our opponents. That's the key multiplier for us as a Navy, and that's our North Star that we must remain focused on. We have no room for complacency. Each ship, squadron, and command must hold themselves accountable. We need to continue to get real and to get better.